Hi, I'm John McGuire, founder and director of the Kinesiology Institute. Thank you for tuning into this video. And be sure to subscribe to our channel and click the bell to be notified when we post new content. And go to kinesiologyinstitute.com to learn more about applied kinesiology. We're going to start with just showing simple muscle testing. And um, you're familiar with this, so I'm going to have you just hold your arm out about 45 degrees. Now, when you're testing someone, here's the key. You want to remind them it's not a strength test, and you don't have any challenges in your shoulder, right? So they make sure their shoulder's, you know, not in any acute state. You have the hand relaxed, the arm relaxed, except the elbow straight. And then with your whole body relaxed, you just meet my gentle pressure. As I get, just push into your arm, meet my pressure, ready, and hold, 1,001, 1,002. So I'm pushing for about two seconds and she's got a strong response. Now I wanna see what it looks like when it switches off. There's different ways to do that. One way is I want you just to say a name that isn't your own. So say, my name is Fred. Okay, my name is Fred. And hold as I push, and your body says, well, that's not true. So it's kind of like a lie detector in a sense. But when you say a lie, it's stressful, and your, your nervous system says, that's a stressor. Now say, my name's Luba. My name is Luba. And hold, and very good, it's solid. So now we're gonna do a little challenge here for the eye muscles. So I'm gonna have you look back and forth, and all of you can look back and forth as well, and see if there's any stress in doing that, okay? Now hold as I push, and see how our arm goes weak? Now what you can do then to correct this is you're going to rub these points right here under the collarbone. I'll let you rub your own, I'll rub mine, and everyone out there, you rub yours. The other hand can touch the uh, belly button. So the umbilicus is a acupressure point known as conception vessel 8 and these points up here are kidney 27. Now while you do that move your eyes back and forth. Now what this does is it helps to integrate your brain hemispheres such that you can use your whole brain which is often good before learning. It also these points on the off the collarbone here act as energy switches to your eye muscles so they work better. If you ever find you're reading and you can't remember what you read, do this technique and it will immediately change that. Okay, let's have you move your eyes again back and forth and hold. Great. Did you notice any shift after doing it the second time? Yes, I felt stronger. Yeah. So, Definitely. and did you notice any change when you went with your eyes? Was there less stress, you know, when you're doing that? Yes, I really yeah. like that actually.